What's up, YouTubies? Come to see you back in the house again. Man, look. More game. More game. And more game. Right? Look, on this very last day of the month of May, I got some fire game for you on this particular day. Welcome back to the channel, subscribers, family, and friends. Let's talk about summer heat and tires. That's right. Summer heat and tires. I was looking at my tires the other day, and I began to notice that in the last month of working, my tires have wore. I'm not going to say significantly, but enough to where I've noticed, okay, we can tell that that road is hot now, and when the road is hot like that, your tires wear a little bit more frequently, right? And so you have to stay on top of that, checking your tires more frequently, kicking them, bumping them, getting them drivers, telling them they got to kick and bump them tires before they pull out of your yard. When they come in, you know, at the shift chain, night shift, get on, check these tires, man, because they're starting to wear, you know, if you're running caps, you know, things can happen. Caps peel, caps start breaking, start getting some breakage. You know, caps peel, break, they can tear up some stuff, right? So what are the pros and cons of summer heat in the tires? I'm going to talk to you from a standpoint of virgin versus cap. Somebody in a recent live asked about that, right? So here's what the CEO does. I do run some caps. I do run virgin. I do both. Let me just share it with you. But in the wintertime, I definitely don't have any problem running uh, caps in the winter for sure because in the winter, road not hot, right? But in the summertime, as I'm getting ready to do now is buy a set of uh, eight of some um, virgins to put on the truck because I just don't even want to have the issue with the summer heat. We can see already it's May. We're in the mid-90s every day now. It's going to be a hot summer, right? And I just don't even want to deal with the problem of dealing with the caps in the summer. I'll put these virgins on. We'll roll them to the end of the year. At least I know. And I'm going to be all good. Why, CEO, are you doing that, right? Because the summer heat, again, can cause breakage, right? Can cause uh, those caps to start splitting, can because they're going to wear a little faster, right? And some of them can't hold up to that heat, right? And when caps peel, caps blow, they can cause some damage to your flat mud flap, the, the hanger that holds your mud flap. They can pop back up and hit somebody's windshield. They can do some damage. They can bend your fender that's right in front of your wheel. All kind of stuff, right? I've had it to happen. That's why I can tell you from experience. So for me, I'm going to run uh, virgins, right? But let me say this. If you're a guy that's got some caps that are your own, right? The danger really is is when you buy some ca old caps, right? Old caps just, it's an old casing, right? You can typically look at those tires, see the date or a number on the side of the caps, or tell you how old that casing is, right? But if you ran virgins and you're going to get your own virgins recap, that's the best way to go. I just gave you a major game right there. If you ran virgins, don't run them all the way down till you get ball. Run them down till you're leaving a little bit of tread on there. Take and get your own caps, your own virgin casings, recap. That way you know what you got when you, when you get them back, right? Costs $100, $120, $155 to get those tires recapped. Or if you're going to buy caps, buy new caps. Buy new caps. Verify that by looking at them. Tell those people you want new caps. Don't just come in there and say, well, I want a, a grip, open, uh, open shoulder tire that's a, a cap. They'll give you anything, right? Tell them you want new caps. I do. I run new caps when I run caps, right? So I'm just giving you pros and cons. The summer heat will take a toll. You got to decide which way you want to handle it. I don't want guys calling me, talking about a flat, Captain Peel and all that. So I'm going to put some virgins on my 18, on cross the back, all eight. Take those off. I'm still going to have the, uh, about five of those tires that are beginning to wear. So I probably won't recap them because they were caps. And then I'm going to take and keep three tires for spares, which are still in really good shape. Therefore, I'm putting eight virgins on the truck. Three of those tires are still good. I'm going to keep them as spares, and we're going to roll like that. Just bought the 19. All those tires are good. I should be able to make it through this summer with that, right? Summer heating tires. Beware. All right? One of the subscribers, Ken S. out of Ohio, he bought four caps, $250 apiece. The virgins were 375 which is probably with all virgins running 375 I Actually, Ken, that's what I'm getting ready to pay per virgin down here at 375 So that's a good price, man. So look. Pick your poison, but beware in the summer, summer's going to wear tires more, and sometimes old caps especially uh, will not hold up to the heat. They'll peel on you and do some damage. Got your CEO. Look, video been valuable to you. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'm out of here. I'm gone.